Then nearby in Romulus, flooding at Detroit Metro Airport caused a lot of problems for people with flight plans. The drains inside the tunnels leading to the McNamara Terminal just could not keep up with that heavy rain. That forced the airport to shut down early this morning. Andres Gutierrez joins us with the details from Detroit Metro Airport. The tunnel on Dingle Drive is open in both directions tonight. Inside McNamara Terminal, there are lines as far as the eye can see with more than 200 delays and 100 cancellations. These folks are trying to figure out, will they fly out tonight? It's a big old cluster. Benita De La Cruz didn't think she'd have to be drying out after landing this morning at McNamara Terminal. They should have made it better known that it was flooded and they should have had us riding buses on the tarmac back down this way, logistic wise, I mean, that would have been smarter instead of all of us sitting there waiting. There's people still sitting there waiting, not knowing what's going on. She and several others waded through the flood waters on Dingle Drive. It was cold, but it was good because I had other people walking with us. So it was good that, you know, I had people to walk with and talk to, and we just got it through. We walked single file all the way through. We didn't walk down the middle, we walked along the sidewalk, which was less deep. Mm -hmm. But going down that way, as you can see, I'm, this is where the water line got to. In a span of five hours, the airport got hammered with a little over three inches of rain. We uh, were on vacation in Canada and we drove back uh, starting out at four o'clock this morning to arrive at about quarter to nine because of the traffic and only to find out that our that Delta is flooded and they can't get us flights out. Some travelers wish they would have known about the closure sooner. Nobody at the terminal really knows what's going on either. Nobody's giving you any information. The closest alert was a sign just not even that far from here that just said McNamara access is closed due to flooding and you know the emergency staff they don't know anything. Conditions were so bad this morning the FAA stopped all incoming flights for several hours. It would have been nice to have some information or to at least know that okay your flight's going to be delayed four hours or something but we're just we can't get any information. According to a Delta spokesperson customers are automatically rebooked when a cancellation occurs but with another round of severe weather expected to Tonight, we'll see what happens. Reporting at DTW Airport, Andres Gutierrez, CBS News, Detroit.